Hi, my name is Richard from Main Books and I'm here to talk about The Fight by Norman Mailer. This is the first Mailer book I'd ever read. It recounts the 1974 World Heavyweight Championship between Muhammad Ali and George Foreman in Zaire. The fight is famously known as the Rumble in the Jungle. I'm a big fan of boxing books and a big fan of anything that really tells the story of the life of Muhammad Ali and this is one of the most important events in his career. The best part of the book by far is how Mailer describes the round-by-round -round action. He goes through um, how Ali uses his rope-a-dope strategy, which means he basically leans against the ropes and takes horrible punishment from Foreman, who eventually wears himself out. And at the end of the fight, the exhausted Ali knocks out the even more exhausted Foreman. But Mailer also uh, recounts the personalities who travel to Africa to see the fight. You hear about uh, George Plimpton from the Paris Review, who's a, a big boxing fan. Hunter S. Thompson is there on assignment. Jim Brown, the, the football star, is there. And the British TV presenter David Frost is there. Huge number of personalities, all trying to see what is happening in what is the, the sporting events of the year, which actually turned out to be one of the sporting events of the century. Um, sometimes Mailer does become verbose, his writing style does become a little bloated at times, but really this book is a, it recounts a moment in boxing history and for that it's a fascinating book.